Good morning, family. The Word of God is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our paths. Here is your morning manna for today. Psalm 30, verse 5. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Amen. Brother and sister, life and death are in the power of the tongue, so it is important that we speak life over ourselves, our family, and circumstances. So, today in light of the scripture we just read, I wanted to give you some encouraging words from the Lord for comfort. God is a God of restoration, so no matter what you've gone through, God is here right now, and He was there for you back then. He is always with you. He will get you through it, and you will have a victory in Jesus' name. So let's start with Psalm 34, verses 17 through 18. The righteous cry, and the Lord heareth, and delivereth them out of their troubles. Matthew 11, verse 28. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Isaiah 41, verse 10. Fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee, yea, I will help thee, yea, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Psalm 9, verse 9. The Lord also will be a refuge for the oppressed. A refuge in time of trouble. Philippians 4, verse 6 through 7. Be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your request be made known unto God. One of my favorites, Jeremiah 29, 11. For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, saith the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. Amen. So just take hold of those scriptures. The Word of God is living. Take hold of these living scriptures. Make them a Part of you. If you have any negativity inside of you, get those thoughts, ideas, lies, and fill you yourself up with the word of God, and you will have the victory. Amen. So as I always we're going to close out with Psalm 84 11. This is a promise from God about you. For the Lord God is a sun and shield. The Lord will give grace and glory. No good thing will he withhold from them that walk uprightly. And if you've blessed, been blessed by this devotional, feel free to subscribe and join this family. Come here every weekday morning to be encouraged with God's word. Have a victorious day in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you, man.